More than 70 years after her death, Henrietta Lacks' mark on uh, medical research lives on, and a group of lawmakers want to honor her with the Congressional Gold Medal. Lacks was a cancer patient at Johns Hopkins in Baltimore in the 1950s when doctors removed tissue samples for research without her consent. Her cells became the first human cell line to reproduce indefinitely, becoming a critical research tool for the development of vaccines and medical treatments to this day. Lack's family and lawmakers are now pushing to honor her legacy and raise awareness about the recognition she was denied in her lifetime. Her impact was medical miracles. To be here today and how everybody's listening to the Lax family story is amazing in itself. I'm hurt today. Filled with joy, but hurt. And to this family, I want to simply publicly apologize. For this should have never happened. The Lax family is suing the biotech company Thermo Fisher, saying the company has made millions from mass producing Lax cells for decades.